Walpole has just a single senior on the team, Shannon Jordan. Juniors Natalie Griffin, Jess Jackman, Jackman, and Elise Scales will add some varsity experience from a year ago. When they qualified for postseason play for the third straight year and fourth time in five years. Walpole had a 14 and eight final mark last year, did advance to the division one uh, quarterfinals before being ousted by Needham. The future does look promising for the Blue Thunder as six sophomores, Brooke Wallonis, Chenea Odobingo, Odenigbo, Odenigbo, Grace Ryan, Bridget Welch, Chloe Binden, and Katie Hurley will see minutes this winter. Freshman Haley Bigham and Lauren Offgant round out the squad. Both Brooke Wallonis and Chenea Odenigbo were both tabbed by the Boston Herald as players to watch this winter. Newton North is led by captains Ellie Solomon, Alexis Hunter Burton, Michaela O'Neill, and Thalia Shepard. Solomon and Hunter Burton are the only two seniors on the team, while O'Neill and Shepard are 11th graders. The Tigers will go with four juniors, five sophomores, and a freshman, Clarice Borges. In the Newton loss last uh, earlier this week. Uh, Chenanye had 22 points and Brooke Wallonis 10, while in the opener against Milton, uh, Wallonis had 16 points and Chenanye 11. Both teams uh, in their huddles for last minute instructions. And we are about to have our opening series here. Seems really, really strange not to have uh, people in the stands, but we're getting used to that now. So. teams getting ready to come out. Like I said, Walpole at one and one will be looking to avenge uh, an earlier setback to the Tigers. Harry, uh, Harry Murphy will be joining us with some color commentary. Harry, uh, any ideas on the game? Well, I mean, if it's anything like the, uh, the junior varsity game, um, it's gonna be a tight match. We saw the junior varsity game. Walpole had a Walpole had a very commanding lead towards the beginning, but then they started to crumble. Hopefully, uh, Walpole can form their lead early and actually hold on to it. Right, being at home, um, you hopefully the the team will uh, be able to get going a little bit more. All right, Newton out on the court. Newton starters include Abigail Wright, Michaela O'Neill, Thalia Shepard, uh, Sophia, no, uh, Ellie Solomon, and uh, Alexis Hunter Bur Burton for Walpole. We will have Lauren Offgant, Shanae Obingo, Grace Ryan. Katie Hurley and Haley Bingham. No, I'm sorry, Brooke Wallonis. Okay, Newton in the corner going underneath. Knocked away by Chenene. Bringing it down for Walpole is Grace Ryan. Uh, actually, it was offhand to Wallonis. Wallonis going to her left. Gets it over. Back over to Ofkin. Ofkin driving in. Looking underneath goes back to Wallonis. Wallonis up top. Ofkin. And the ball is shot. Newton bringing it down. It's right with the ball. She gets it over to Paloma Garcia. 
Garcia for a three. No good. It's an air ball. It goes out. It'll be Walpole ball. Malone is inbounds to Offgant. Gets it back. Being guarded by Solomon. Malonis gets it in close to uh, Hurley. Hurley has it taken away by Solomon. Solomon goes the length of the court looking for O'Neill and it goes out of bounds. Oh, they said it was off Walpole. Okay, Shepard with the ball. Crossover to Solomon. Solomon gets it over to Garcia. He stops, pops, no good. Rebound. Pulled down by Hurley. Over in the corner to Wallonis. Wallonis into Shanae. Stops, pops, no good. Rebound by O'Neill for Newton. Back to Shepard. No good. Ball out of bounds off Wallonis. It'll be Newton ball on the sidelines. It'll be Paloma Garcia inbounding. Over to Michaela O'Neill. Goes out of bounds. That went off Newton. Wallonis inbounds to Ryan. Grace bringing the ball down over the Walpole W at center court. It's a, to Hurley. Hurley coming down on the left. Looking for somebody. Gets it out to Ryan. Ryan to Shanani and to Wallonis. Underneath to Hurley. She lays it up and in. Walpole score, draws first blood here for a two to nothing lead. Garcia has her pass stolen. Goes over to Wallonis. Wallonis underneath the Shanae. She lays it up and in. Walpole up four to nothing here. Nearly going. Garcia gets the ball up top on the right. In the corner to Garcia. Garcia way out. Wow, nothing but net on that from way out deep by uh, Gus. That was by Wright. There's a steal by Garcia. She hands it off to Wright and she lays it up and in. We're tied here at four. to Waltham. She gets it over to Haley Bingham. Bingham tries a long three. A little low. Shanae saves it. Nice save. Nice dive. And it'll be tied up. As uh, Haley Bingham uh, Brigham drove in there, dove in there to get that. Uh, it's important well, to have big plays like that if you want to win the game. Exactly. You're not going to win the game without those. Ryan inbounding. He gets it to Wallonis, gets it back. Drops it back for Wallonis. Wallonis going to her right. And long, goes long and off the hands of Odin Igbo. Down is Garcia for the Tigers. She gets it over to O'Neill. Back, she tosses it away. She was looking for Garcia and tosses it away. 
Genesis Garcia coming in for Newton. it up and in nicely, Haley Brigham. Ball goes out of bounds, off Walpole. Bridget Welch comes in for Walpole, replacing Brigham over to uh, got Genesis Garcia. She puts up a three, it's good. Eight to six, Newton on top. Wallonis with the ball. Little travel there on Walpole. Pack your bags and get your tickets. Yeah. <laughs> Lara Aguzzi in for the Tigers. Gosh, Genesis Garcia bringing it up, gets it over to Shepard. In the corner to Aguzzi. Aguzzi looks at the baseline, gets Burgess. Blocked by Odenigbe, on Anigbo. Walpole's played very well on defense. They have. A lot of turnovers. Chloe Binden with the ball for Walpole. She gets underneath and lays it, Chenea lays it up and in. They're tied again at eight. Oh, uh, went into the backboard as uh, Aguzzi couldn't handle the pass from Garcia. Sophia Beatrice in for Newton. Wallonis gets it to Ryan. Ryan, high pass into Katie Hurley. Hurley looking. She's got Ryan. Ryan to Welch. And we've got a foul on Newton, number 13. It was Abigail Wright. The second on Newton. Walpole without the services of uh, Natalie Griffin tonight because of uh, illness. Off Gant, gets it over to Wallonis. Wallonis dribbling to Off Gant. Off Gant looking for Hurley, couldn't find her. Newton came up with the ball. Bringing it down is uh, Borges. There's a three, bang! by Genesis Garcia, her second three, the third of the night for ne uh, Newton. They've been extremely accurate with those. Right. Well, the travel Pack on... your bags and get your tickets ready. left here in the first quarter. Newton holding a 11-08 lead, thanks and mostly for a, a trio of trays, a trio of trays, try saying that a few times, by the Tigers. Gorgeous has a ball stolen, Wallonis with it. Brooke brings it down. And a foul called on Aguzzi.
Lauren off again to inbounds for Walpole. He gets it to Brigham. Brigham drives to her right, comes down and loses it out of bounds. It will be Newton Ball. A goozy bringing her down. Foul on uh, Michaela O'Neill. Thirty-five point eight seconds left in this first quarter. Lonis is drive and. Attempt, I'm sorry, it wasn't Wallonis, it was Offgan. Rolled around the rim and out. Garcia bringing it in, goes over. Foul on Walpole, it looks like Katie Hurley. Yep, Katie Hurley gets up the foul. And Newton calls a timeout. We have just 16.8 seconds left in this first quarter. Newton on top, 11 to eight. Three pointers, two of them by uh, Genesis Garcia and another one by Abigail Wright have been the big guns for the Tigers. Uh, Wright has also scored a, a basket from the floor for Walpole. Uh, let's see. Cheneye Odenigbo has four points. Katie Hurley has two. And Haley Brigham has two. So the fairly even uh, uh, scoring for Walpole. Like we've said uh, earlier, uh, Newton has been deadly with their threes. I think they're three for four on, on threes so far. Yeah. Whenever they score a three, Walpole scores a two and... Right. All right. That's what, that's what the difference is. Genesis Garcia inbounding for Newton. She gets it to Borges. Borges, the only freshman on the team for Newton. Another one. The uh, three. No good. So good. Walpole with it. They've got to get down. Three seconds. Comes over. Three. Oh, ah. just shot by Haley Brigham. Nice a try. But we have finished eight minutes of this game. Newton on top, 11 to 8. Uh, Walpole staying close, that's a good thing to see. Yes. Uh, good defensive play because they're forcing Newton to shoot from out deep. Unfortunately, Newton's hitting them, but uh, it's better than letting them have you know uncontested layups or shots from in close. Agreed. If they could just defend the threes, they'd be perfect. Both teams come back out on the floor. And Newton will inbound. 
Williams. It's Lara Aguzzi doing the honors. She gets it to Paloma Garcia. Paloma's a, both the Paloma and Genesis are sophomores, so they could be twins. She loses the ball. It's oh, taken by Brigham. Yikes. Bad pass goes underneath. That is going to hurt Walpole. Up and in for Garcia. They're going to be seeing that in their sleep. Yeah. All right, off Gant with the ball to her right, coming back to her left, looking, looking, looking. Wide open. Bang, nothing, nothing but, but net. net. Haley Brigham. 13-11, need him on top. Their lead cut to two. Borges with the ball. She tops, no, here she is. Throws it up, a long rebound. Picked off by Janenye. And McConaugh looking. Janenye gets it back. Nice play. Excellent job maintaining possession. Another and three. Uh, no good by uh, Brigham. Tried another one. Borges with the ball. Rebound. Comes back out to Offgant. Offgant slows it down a little bit. Drives to her right. Looking, looking over to the, gets it over to Ryan. Ryan looking for Chenea. Ryan. Stolen. Oh, yikes. Picked off nicely by Second Garcia. Lays Walpole. it up and in by Borges. 15-11, Newton back up on top by four. Walpole's got to do better with that. They can't be turning the ball over that much. Yeah. Newton's looking for that pass, too. Yeah, they're reading it like a children's yep. book. The pass by... Uh, Offgant goes out of bounds, and a timeout call by uh, Walpole. Well, actually, I'm done. And coming in is Wallonis. Like I said, Newton North is reading Walpole's offense like a children's book. They gotta, they gotta figure that out. Right. right stop and pop. No good. Rebound over to Wallonis on a miss by Shepard. Wallonis circles around. She gets it to Ryan. Ryan, the pass is up high and taken by Newton's uh, Shepard in the corner, wide open. Ah, Bang! Yes. Wide open by uh, Ellie Solomon. 18-11, another three, the fourth of the game for the Tigers. Welch with the ball, gets it over. Oh her. my. Uh, a foul on 15, uh, Paloma Garcia. Sophia Beatrice in for Newton. Malonis, no good. He tried a three from the corner. Here's uh, Solomon. Solomon goes down, stops, gets it back to right, right. Her three falls short. Wallonis with the rebound. Brooke bringing it down over the middle of the court. Drives and on the floor, foul on uh, Solomon for Newton. And a timeout called. I think probably Newton with the, uh, the, the call. 4.44 left in the half. Newton with a seven point lead, their biggest lead of the game at 18 to 11. And uh, two thirds of their points have come uh, from three pointers. They've got four of them. It's crazy. Yeah, they're pretty deadly with that. <laughs>
Walpole, uh, like we said, with just one senior on the team, Shannon Jordan. And uh, I don't think I've seen her out on the floor yet tonight. I don't think she's been out, no. Oh, she hasn't been, okay, yeah. And like I said, uh, the missing Natalie Griffin, who is out with illness. All right, Walpole coming back out onto the floor. Grace Ryan looking to inbounds. She gets it into Welch. Welch drives the lane, puts it up. No good. Rebound on the oh, floor. Oh, man. Oh, Waffles man. Able to kick. Still there. Cheneye up. No, the foul was on the floor. Looks like uh, I think the foul was called on. Nice. So that was an and one. Right? Right. No, it didn't get counted. Wow. So first one is up and no good. Newton gets the ball Long down fast. Pass. Throws it out to Wright. Wright comes over. Puts it up. Newton gets the rebound, comes out. A drive ah. and an underhand scoop by Beatrice. Man. 20 to 11. 407 left in the half. Malonis with the ball. Looking to go in. The inbound is looking for Chenea, everyone, Newton is really covering down on that. They, they know that Walpole's trying to get inside and uh, they're just waiting for that pass. Lays it up and in nicely by Ryan. Foul on the floor before the shot. I don't know if it's Walpole's strategy or not, but they seem, uh, seem kind of slow. Uh, when they're running the ball from each side. When Newton North's running it to, yeah. to their basket, they're all running all together, but some of Walpole's players are hanging back, and I don't right. think that's faring them fa uh, too well. And the corner shot. Like they're all, they're all hanging back. Right. Where Newton North, like they're all together. Maybe that maybe Walpole's doing it so they can pass it better, but I'm not too sure what's going on. And off can to Hurley. Hurley looking for someone. She gets it to Walonas. Brooke drives. Ah oh, man. In the corner to Walonas. It's stolen. A left of the field. Drived in a layup by. Garcia, Genesis Garcia. Newton's built their lead up to nine points. Walpole's passing the ball too quickly. They gotta look where they're throwing it. Yeah. Baseline, and he steps out, nope. Calling a foul on get Ryan. Okay, Brigham is in replacing uh, Offgant. Uh, travel on Pack your bags Garcia. And get your tickets. Comes over to Ryan. She gets it in to Brigham. Brigham to Walonis. Walonis having trouble there. 
Back to Brigham, she puts up a three. Oh, no good, the rebound by Walpole. Comes out to Walonis, bang. Walpole's oh. trying to chop that lead. Down to 22 to 15, and the shot's no good. Brooke with the rebound. Seems like. Being covered by uh, the freshman, Borges. No good. Newton with the rebound. Comes over to uh, Genesis Garcia. She backs in. And a travel call. So uh, Solomon and Guzzi come in for the Tigers. There's been a lot of traveling this game. There has, yeah. COVID's still happening. You shouldn't be traveling. Ryan with the ball, coming in, lays it up, in, and she got fouled. Waffles chopping away at that lead. 22-17. Okay. Grace trying to make it a three-point play here. Is and good. Four point. Yeah, it's a four point now. Five straight points for Walpole here. A minute 19 five, left five. in the first half. No, nope, they updated it. Four points. Let's see. There's a nice steal there by Brigham. Steal. Newton gets it back right away to Borges underneath. Ah. Ah. Basket by Aguzzi, and the foul is on Brigham. Still haven't updated the scoreboard yet. I don't know if it's delayed or... There we go. And she gets the free throw. Newton's lead is back up to seven with a minute to go in the first half. Ball goes out of bounds off Walpole. The Tigers will inbound. Aguzzi with it. She gets it back. In the corner for a three, no good. Newton comes down with the rebound though. In the corner to Solomon, no good. Newton again with the rebound. Borges with the ball, looking underneath, nobody there for the Tigers. Walpole will get the ball with 23 seconds exactly in the half. Ryan bringing the ball down. a foul on Newton, number 11. I don't know why the coach is trying to challenge the refs. <laughs> it's unprofessional the way that they yell at the refs like that. All right, so Brigham will take the free throw. It's no good. Borges to Solomon and the corner to Borges. He hit it at the buzzer. So I think Walpole's going to have to do better communicating with their passes. They're going to have to do better staying together when they when they go up the court. And I think also they're going to have to um, try to play better defense against the three pointers. Yeah. Those are the only improvements I think Walpole can make. And then they've got a winning formula. Right. They've got to cut down that nine point gap though. So we uh, going down, like we said there, two and a half minutes between each quarter. 
as uh, compared to the 15 minute we used to have uh, between each uh, break. But with COVID, we want to get the games in and out nice and fast. We hope you're enjoying this Walpole Media Corporation broadcast of Walpole High School Girls Basketball. Rick Brown here with Harry Murphy and Tommy Connor on the camera doing an outstanding job. Harry's a senior right here at Walpole High. Tommy is a sophomore at Endicott College up in beautiful Beverly on the ocean. We understand they still are having trouble getting a new nickname for the Walpole athletic teams. And I like Blue Thunder. I think there would be a great new name. I can hear the thunder rumbling down the field. I see blue uniforms with orange lightning bolts coming across either the front or the back. Blue Thunder. Vote for Blue Thunder. <laughs> I think that's an excellent name. Thank you. That's something everyone would get behind. There's no, uh, you know, there's no controversies about that. Right. It could be something like that. Yep. Yep. You know. Have the lightning bolt coming out of the W even. Yeah. For Walpole. There's endless possibilities with that. Well. And that way you also don't have to change the, uh, the color scheme either, right? I know the renaming commission has said that color changes aren't, you know, even in talking, so why would you even consider a name like the Patriots? Right, yeah. I mean, that's a red, white, and blue team. Yeah, sure. you're going you're gonna to tarnish it if it's got uh, orange, orange white, and blue. Orange and blue, yeah. It doesn't make any sense, but I think the, the, the blue thunder or even the thunder is something thunder, that you can work yep. with. Blue Thunder, Thunder, Rolling Thunder. I like Thunder as a nickname, especially with Walpole Athletics. Yeah. Anyway, we're getting ready for third quarter action for Walpole. We have Chidenye Odenbigabo, uh, Grace Ryan, Lauren Offgant, Brooke Wallonis, and Katie Hurley on the floor. Ryan looking to inbound, she gets it to Offgant. Offgant going to her left. She gets it to Wallonis. Brooke trying to break free, she's got a little daylight, puts it up. Three points for go. Wallonis. Let's hope that's not the, the last. That right. See. Yeah, Brooke was wide open on that shot and she made sure that it went in. <laughs> A put back by number 12, Michaela O'Neill. Paloma Garcia. That's out off of Newt Solomon, knocked it out. Good defense, but she knocked it out of bounds. Okay, Newt, uh, Walpole bringing the ball down. It's Lauren Offgan. She hands it to Wallonis. Rook looking for a little bit of daylight. He gets it into Odenbach. Underneath the Hurley. She lays it up and she got fouled. Seems like there are definitely being some changes made. Foul on O'Neill for Newton. 
fairly looking to cut the deficit to four points, five points. And she does. 29-24, Newton on top. Throughout the game, they've done a really good job of trying to cut the deficit, but they can't keep cutting it. They're right. just kind of halfway cut, and then it goes right back to where it was. So hopefully yep. they can you know, keep cutting away. Hurley with the rebound to Wallonis. Wallonis. Oh! With a Hurley. Hurley back to Wallonis. She's got daylight. Uh, no good. The rebound goes to Newton. Stolen. Off the hands of uh, Ofgen. Nice try. No good. Hurley with the rebound. She gets it to Ofgen to bring back down. Uh, oh. Ofgen's pass to uh, Ryan off her hands and out of bounds. All right, uh, Paloma Garcia bringing the ball down for Newton. Over in the corner to Solomon. Solomon backing in, looking, and we've got, as uh, Wallonis goes in and grabs the ball, calls for the jump. Solomon will inbounds. Over on the far side. And it looks like we've got a foul. Five point uh, deficit. Let's see if something can be done. Okay, that wasn't a foul. Actually, the uh, shot clock hadn't started running. I thought. Rebound. Odin Igbo with the rebound. She gets it to Wallonis. Ah. Stolen by Odin Igbo. Good! He puts it up and in. Only three now. Good 29, couple. 26. Newton gets it back. Here comes Walpole coming right down the floor. Underneath. The dive, the arrow going Walpole's way. Walpole's done very well tonight, recovering the, uh, the dive balls, so to speak. Right. Okay, Ryan inbounding for Walpole. She gets it to Chloe Binden. Chloe gets it back from Offkin. Oh. She was looking for Wallonis and the one out of bounds. See, their passes are too fast. Yeah. I get it's a fast paced game, but you gotta think about where you're throwing that ball. Because the court's only so big. Oh, excellent defense. Steal. Oh, what a uh, uh, nice steal by Wallonis, but she unfortunately, while saving it, threw it right into the hands of a tiger. No good. Rebound. Volleyball. Solomon and Offgan battle for the rebound. It will be like Solomon Lord. getting it, yep. Okay. Genesis Garcia comes in replacing Solomon. 4.30 to go, let's see what they can do. O'Neill, Garcia stops, oh. pops, around the rim and out. Ball off, goes off of Walpole. Not sure who tipped it, but. Uh, Genesis Garcia inbounding. She gets it to right, right to O'Neill, back to right in the corner, back to Borges to right. Good, it's a three, she was just outside the line. Garcia with the ball over in the corner to her sister. No good. A foul on Walpole. Oh. 
Driving down the underhand layup. Cheninye with the rebound. A long pass out to Binden. She looks for... Newton bringing it down to Borges. Borges off the side, the rebound. Put back up by Shepard. 36-26, 10 point lead for the Tigers. Their biggest lead of the game. It's one step forward and two steps back. Walpole was doing really good for about five minutes. Yeah. If that. A three, it's a bang. Newton's starting to really drop them in here. I can't believe this game was within one score. It's dead. Yeah. You know, only like three or four minutes ago. So. A clinic ever since. There we go. Newton up uh, to a lead by a baker's dozen here with 2.54 left to go in the third quarter as they've outscored Walpole uh, 12 to eight since uh, the third quarter began. Walpole uh, has to settle down a little bit with their passing and be a little bit more sure. I know Newton is putting tremendous uh, defensive pressure on them, but uh, Walpole uh, has to take that extra split second to look where you're passing because Newton has scored a lot of theirs on intercepted passes and coming back down the floor quickly. Yep. Who won, the tortoise or the hare? <laughs> All right, Ryan will inbound to either Brigham or Wallonis. It goes to Brigham. Haley bringing the ball down. Gets over, Sonic drives down in the corner to Wallonis for three, in and out. And it's Garcia, a foul on the floor there, and it's on Wallonis. Okay, Genesis Garcia gets it into right, right over to Aguzzi. Aguzzi gets it to right to Garcia. She goes over to Borges. Borges puts it up, no good, and Wallonis with the rebound. Brooke gets it over to Welch. No, it's not, I'm sorry, it's uh, Ryan. Ryan to Wallonis. Good handoff. Underneath the Hurley. Hurley puts it up, no oh, good. Man. Slaps the rebound, the rebound comes back to Walpole, lays it up and no good by Brigham, but she got fouled. Just under two minutes remain in the third period for the record. The first one is no good. Brigham tries, and that one rolls around the rim and out also. So close, but so far. Yep. It's defined Walpole in a lot of ways this game. The passes, the shots, the Ooh, lead. Three in and out. Wallonis. No good. Brooke comes down with the rebound. She tries a three, it's an air ball, and out of bounds. It'll be Newton ball. 
Jess Jackman on the floor for Walpole. A foul on Hurley. Walpole's defense has got to be quicker. Okay. Genesis Garcia inbounds to Borges. Genesis, she puts it up, no good. The rebound, no good. Walpole with the rebound. Brigham with the rebound. Knocked out by Garcia. Genesis diving for that ball, trying to keep it in. Jess Jackman will inbounds for Walpole. And she gets it over to Brigham. Brigham to Wallonis. And the corner, it was Binden, and her pass is intercepted. And a foul back in the backcourt on Binden. 42.9 seconds left in the third quarter. Aguzzi to Genesis Garcia. <coughs> Garcia's pass gets it over to Borges. Borges puts it up, no good. <coughs> Garcia gets the rebound, brings it back up top. They get a new shot clock underneath the Borges. Borges travels. 23.7 seconds left in this third quarter. Newton still up by 13. Walpole's got to get more focused. Abigail Wright coming back in for the Tigers. Brooke with the ball. Over to Ryan. Ryan going four seconds. Wallonis puts it up. No good. Oh, Newton man. with the rebound. And that will end the third quarter here from Walpole High with the Newton North Tigers on top, 39-26. Uh, they outscored Walpole 12-8 in, uh, uh, in that third quarter. Not saying it's impossible. Oh no. Thirteen it's down thirteen with a minute to go, I would say it might be impossible, but Yeah, it's gonna be pretty difficult the way that the game is shaping up to be. will have their work cut out for them here in this fourth quarter. Oh yeah. back out on the floor, the orange and black Tigers. Walpole coming on. It will be Walpole ball. Wallonis inbounding for Walpole. Okay, she gets it over to Brigham. Haley looking. Coming down to her right, drives, stops. Over in the corner to Ryan. Now Ryan back to Hurley, back to Ryan. To Wallonis, Brooke gets it over to Brigham. To Ryan, her shot is no good. Odenigby with the rebound and she puts it in. Wall 
Leopold is down by 11. Garcia, underhand scoop, puts it in. 41-28. The Tigers are on top. Ryan with the ball. Then gets it into Wallonis. And Wallonis, no, they're going to call a jump ball on that. The arrow is in Newton's way, so Ellie Solomon, one of their four captains, will inbounds. How do the jump balls work? Do they just kind of teeter and totter between? You know, they look at the arrow, whichever way the arrow. See where it says possession? Right, oh yeah. Oh, it's underhanded scoop and layup by Wright, and she got fouled. Oh, it was no foul. Newton's lead back up to 15 now. The biggest lead of the game. Brooke with the ball for Walpole. Going to her left. Bringing it down. Walpole's it's playing way too hastily. Stolen by Wright. To Garcia, over to Solomon. Bang, she hits a three. 46, 28, one, two, three, four, five, six threes for Newton North tonight. That's over half of the amount of points that Walpole has. Yeah. All right, Elise Scales, and then she will be shooting. It's the first time we've seen her out. And her first shot is no good. She'll try again. It's up and off the side of the rim. Shepard with the ball for Newton. Over to right, right back to Shepard. She tries the three, no good. It's saved, but thrown right into the hands of Katie Hurley. Wallonis to Scales. Back to Wallonis for a long three, no good. Newton with the rebound. Shepard coming down, lays it up, no good. Uh, O'Neill with the rebound for Newton. And it's fired in by Paloma Garcia. As the Tigers really pulling away now at the 21 point advantage. Five thirty six left in regulation. Very one sided game. In the second half it has. Well the first half was a lot closer. Yeah. Binden getting ready to come back in along with Off Gant for Walpole. I've been working these games since January 7th and I only discovered a couple of days ago that their whistles are those things in their hands. You the, the little clickers that they have. Oh yeah. Those double as whistles. I just found that out like two or three uh, days. Oh right, ago. yeah. So that they don't have to keep Their blowing masks. through a mask and have the spittle coming out. Thank you once again, COVID. <laughs> this is why we can't have nice things. <laughs> <laughs> this is true. Coming back out on the floor. Newton has already made the transition. Wallonis will inbounds for Walpole. She gets it to Offkant. Lauren coming down. Going to her left. Looking for 
scales and it goes out of bounds. Paloma Garcia gets the ball back from uh, Solomon. A long bomb. She was looking for O'Neill, but it was way over her head. Scales will inbounds to Offgant. Lauren coming down, driving. Gets it out to Wallonis. Brooke driving in, puts it up. She got fouled outside. The foul is on Genesis Garcia. Five oh five left in regulation. And it took too long. Newton ball. Beatrice, Genesis Garcia and Borges come back in for the orange and black. Genesis with the ball. Looking underneath. Got Shepard blocked and knocked out of bounds. Good heads up play by uh, Scales. Shepard gets it over to Wright. Gets back to Borges. Borges puts it up around the rim, no good. Odenigbo with the rebound. Malonis to Odenigbo, she lays it up, no good. Gets a rebound, puts it back up and in. Back under 20. Out top to Beatrice, to Borges. Borges rescues the ball and then puts it up and in. 51-30. Newton with the huge lead. Scales tries a three, no good. Ball comes down to Borges underneath to Shepard. Shepard no good, the rebound by Beatrice. She gets fouled. Just under four minutes to go. Beatrice at the line. Shooting two, the first one is no good. Walpole sending back out Hurley. And Shannon Jordan, her first appearance tonight. And, and the second one is good by uh, Beatrice. Ryan with the ball, trying to move on in, handing it off to Hurley. Hurley, no good. Gets her own rebound, puts it back again. And a foul on Hurley. Three thirty-eight left in regulation. Allison Buba inbounded for Newton. Comes over to Aguzi. Aguzi to Alexis Hunter Burton. To Beatrice. Beatrice drives an underhand scoop, no good. The rebound by Shannon Jordan. Ball comes over, under and off again, and Lauren lays it up and in. Ten point game. Good defense by Wallonis. at the line, she'll be shooting two. 
First one is off the rim and out. Bridget Welch comes in, replacing Lauren Offgant for Walpole. And the second one is no good. Hurley gets the rebound. 2.49 remains. Welch with the ball. She gets it up to Wallonis. Brooke in the corner to Ryan. Hurley's rebound attempt was no good. A three by Megan Carey. For Newton. 215. Ball was knocked out of bounds by Newton. Wallonis coming down, gets it over in the corner. To Jordan, her shot was no good. Walpole with the rebound. Hurley gets the rebound. Out to Ju Wallonis. No good, looking for the three. Knocked out of bounds by Newton. It'll be Walpole ball with 154 to go in regulation. Grace Ryan inbounding for Walpole. To Jackman, just back to Ryan. Underneath, stolen by Genesis Garcia. It goes to Aguzzi, back to Garcia. Genesis coming in, backs in, spins, puts it up and in. 57-32, Elise Scales tries to, puts it up, it's no good. They are going too fast for their own good. All right. Shoot it. Genesis get with the ball. Over in the corner, no good. And the rebound pulled down by Welch. Under a minute remains. Bridget gets it to Scales. Uh, travel call. Tigers ball. That clock's got to be reset. It was at 53 when they stopped, and then they let it run to 52. I don't know. I didn't see it. Garcia with the ball. Yeah, the whistle blew at 53, and then they let it run to 52.2 or something like that. Never fixed it. Well, at this point, with a 25-point lead, I don't think yeah, they're going to worry kill. about Yeah, third, three kill. seconds. So Allison Bouba at the line. She drops in the first one. So look for the next one. It is up and in. 59-32, not a good night for the lady Hoopsters tonight. Bridget Excellent Welch night for Newton runs. North though. JV also won. Grace Ryan puts it up, lays it up and in, and she got fouled. Foul is on Megan Carey. And puts it in. Down under 20 seconds to go in this one. Genesis Garcia killing off time. Driving in. Fox Mountain Light Butter. back. And they call five seconds, unable to move the ball up. Ryan inbounding for Walpole. He gets it to Welch. Welch coming down. 
Puts it up, a wild shot. Jordan goes out with a scoop try by Scales, but she traveled. It'll be Newton's ball, and that's it. The final score here from Walpole High, Jim, the Newton North Tigers, 59 to 35. Um, the second half was a killer for Walpole. Um, they were only down by uh, 27 to 18 at the half and were outscored uh, 32 to 17 after the break as uh, Newton was uh, able to run away with this game at the end. Anyway, uh, the t Walpole drops to one and two and will be in action next week, again, we hope, against, I think, Wellesley. Uh, Anyway, we would like to thank you for watching this Walpole Media Corporation broadcast of Walpole High School girls varsity basketball action. Once again, your final score, the Newton North Tigers 59, Walpole 35.